In what ways were the conflicts between the North and South like a rivalry between siblings or feuding neighbors? Slavery in the U.S. was really bad. The slaves were treated horribly. First they were captured from Africa, then had to spend long months on a boat. It was hard for them because they had a lack of food, water, and space. There were also many diseases, so about 10% of the slaves died. After that, the slaves would get off the boat and get fixed up so they looked better than before. Now the slaves are ready for the auction, which the slaves get auctioned off to the slave owners. Then the slaves had to work long, tireless hours with little or no food and water. It was really hard for the slaves. Abraham Lincoln got voted into office, and that was the start of the Civil War. The South didn't want Abraham Lincoln in office because it, it, he would abolish slavery. The South was going to secede to the North, so, so they, the North started the war, so they didn't. Abraham Lincoln wanted to abolish slavery, but at the same time keep the country together. He was the representative for the North. The North was, one, was the one who voted for him and put him in office. Then after the Civil War, Lincoln got assassinated because some people didn't like that he abolished slavery. Jefferson Davis wanted to keep, the, keep slavery and win president against Lincoln. He was the representative for the South. The South voted for him, but he lost. He wanted to keep slavery, so he was with the South. The South has hot, humid summers with mild winters. It has flat land, and that's why it's great for farmers. They grow cotton, indigo, and many other crops. The North has warm summers with cold winters. That's why it isn't good for farming. Instead, the North has many factories and cities. They have the larger population. The North won the victory over the South. It was hard, but they did do it. Slavery was abolished, and those states seceded. The states were almost all united, and the country was happy again. They learned from their mistakes, and now they have. This hopefully will never happen again. Thank you.